Hari, okay. it's raining. We need to find some food. Are we eating at Chom Chom? Uh, no, we're gonna go somewhere across Chom Chom. And I tell you, this will be a gem that you have not discovered or maybe you have not, uh, you have not heard about in Strangun Gardens. Yeah. All right. This is famous. I'll bring you to a place where you will be fully satisfied. All right. What are we having today? All right. RK special and we have roti prata. Uh -huh. We have the curry. I think this is the beef curry. Yep. Potato, sambal, two soft boiled eggs. No, let me and try this one. Oh. This is a fish curry or fish sambal. This is the beef curry, chili, potato, and eggs. Uh, if this is the signature dish that almost everybody is eating, then I think we should give this a shot. You know, this is one of the best dishes to have prata at midnight or the steaming one because it just rained the whole evening. It's super, super cold. And I almost missed recording. <laughs> The best here, Argi, Prata special. The best here, Argi, Prata special. So tell us about your dish. How, how did, why the combination? Combination, I like. Normally the Prata, no Prata only. So, you need add Prata. So, so, I do this one. So, some Prata, big curry. So, some sambal, so egg. Somebody eat the same, very nice. Very nice. The best Prata here. So, are you the boss? No boss, I'm working here. Where's the boss? Boss over there. Kevin, how was it? Okay, while well, you were busy talking and you know, doing what? The prata tastes different. Even though it's all soaked up, yeah. it's still very, very crispy and nice. So, uh, my question, how does it feel to eat without your partner? Or how does it feel to eat when someone is working, Kevin? You had your time to eat, now it's my time. <laughs> <laughs> what have you tasted so far? I just hit, I mixed up the the dish with the runny eggs with yeah. the beef. Um, so far it's just been the prata and the curry. Does it ruin the taste? You no, know, I mean, it does give that, that starchy, that, that little bit of iggy, iggy feeling. But I think the curry is, is, the, is the key thing, the curry. So this is the prata. This is the sambal. Then you do the dish. And... Ready? Oh. The chili is not overwhelmingly hot. The prata is soft and crispy. You can still have the crisps. That's the meat. It's soft and tender. Even those who are in dentists can actually chew this. So the next one, I'm gonna have the fish curry. I don't have to eat for a whole day tomorrow. <laughs> this would last me for a lifetime tomorrow. <laughs> Everybody talks about Chom Chom. No, so no one talks about this place. I think this is quite a hidden gem here in Serangoon Gardens. 24 hours, yeah. anytime you want to eat. Decent crowd. I mean, yes, you have your safe distancing measures, but but this place was packed. It's been packed for a long, long time since 11 when we got here. What I like, this place is dry and clean. It's very different from the traditional prata that you eat, you know, that is separated. I mean, it, it looks soggy, it looks messy, but it still tastes awesome. It's time to feed the camera. You know, I may regret this after this. Oh, well, I may regret it in the morning, but right now, nobody shall stop me yeah. <laughs> from enjoying this meal, really. What's the attraction of the prata? It's simple food, mm -hmm. and it's, it is as local as you can get. The curry, you can't find the taste similar to how the Malaysian would 
this is typically a Singapore food with a taste remains uniquely Singapore. Mm. You're right, even though it's been so with the curry, mm -hmm. you can still feel the crispiness. The crispiness of the, the prata. prata. Yeah. I find it very amazing. This is really worth the try. If you're really hungry and you really think that you want something that will fill you up right in the morning, this will be the one. Post party meal? I can already make. <laughs> I can imagine how the thing will just expand in my intestines. <laughs> I was confessing to Kevin like how I actually deliberately dismiss this restaurant mm -hmm. when I come to Australia. Like I don't think I think it's just another uh, restaurant selling South Indian and North Indian food. Hey, good. Thank you so much. And. Today, 20 years later, I discovered a gem in the whole of China. It's amazing. I have never found this type of dish anywhere else in Singapore. And I missed it for 20 years. How can this be? How can this be? It's better late than ever. Yeah, we have not explored enough. Yeah. I mean, that's why we are here. We are here to explore food. It may be after midnight, but I think that's where this whole place comes to life. It is almost one and it's still packed. Look at the queue. Look at the queue. Right. And it's a queue. So you, so you get see, here. after midnight, only the young ones go out. Come on, like us. <laughs> so make your way though. I mean, there is more to Serengu Garden than Chom Chom. Yeah, I mean, maybe Chom Chom has been. Uh, nationalized but there are other gems in Strangling Gardens that you need to discover and I would really like to thank the producers for introducing me to this really really wonderful food. I've tasted so much and so many yeah. but I've never tasted your combination. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not our creator, it's everywhere we have pizza. But we do something very special. Lah. This type of curry. Curry and then uh, some uh, mutton. And then two half water. Why the hunger? And then we have two type of sambal. The sambal makes better. Delicious. That's the red one? The red one and the brown one. The brown one is what? Both are sambal. Both are sambal, right? Yeah. So you are the one who created this. <laughs> yeah. He said Prata did not make him rich, but he, he owns the place. He's been running this for 15 years. And he has not done any other things. If he doesn't make money, would he want to do any other thing? <laughs> thank you, thank you so much. Thank you for being here. Okay. I think we were talking about meeting nice, kind people. I mean, I'm quite surprised of the hospitality that we have come so far. Uh, would it be the people itself, or would it the time that plays a big part, or is it because? We are the one who brings out the best out of everybody after midnight. So let's see in the episodes to come how how do people fare. All right, I'm look, I look forward to the next one. Yes, don't okay, care. Please put me up early. Okay? <laughs>